guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm showing how to create a snake and ladder game in GeoGebra. Let's start. Snake and For that, first I am insert the image from my system. Now we create a point. We will create a game pointer. So whenever we get a particular number, we will move this in the board. I'm making it a little bit uh, beautiful. This also. I want a blue color. Fine. Now I don't want this object, so I am hiding this object. Hiding this label also. Now you can do this. And I am fixing this. And also I make sure that the layer is zero. Yes. Here also I am putting layer as one. Okay, I need one more. For easy ways, right click and select. Control C, then Control G. Now I put more one more. Any other three other. So three people can play this game. I'm changing the color. Let it be orange. And this dot I am changing. Let it be blue. I'm changing this color to green. And this is this is fine. I'm keeping this on the start. So three people can play this game. Now, now we need a pointer, game point. For that, I'm creating a circle. Here I draw it. So I want uh, six numbers one, two, three, four, five, and six. So I have to divide this 360 degree into six parts. So each part contains uh, an angle of 60 degree. So click here, angle with given size, click the point, click here, then make it 60. Then click OK. Then again do the same.
Okay, now it is red. Now right click here. It's the easy way. Then right click. Show object. Or you can do one thing. Here I wanted this. You can select here. Yes. And right click and select all the points. Click on uh, show label. So it is not selected. Again, show label. Now we have to make it uh, different segments. Uh, for that, you can click here. Again, I am right clicking here. Just show label. Now click on one portion and you can change the color of that. So I am changing everywhere. Because as it is designed for this, so it should be colorful. And also, I am uh, now. I need a slider to rotate the point. Click angle 360 and one degree. So I am. I want uh, alpha. Now I have to create a point. For that angle with given size again you click on that and click here click here instead of 60 degree you have to select alpha okay so when i move this it is Where is our point? Yeah. Now we will create a segment from here to here. Now on that I am creating a vector. Deleting that. Um, if it is not happening, click on a point and put a point there. Then click on vector, then make a vector. Now, now you can hide those points. We do not need this uh, segment. Short. Short. Segment has to be selected. I need to search which segment it is. 
Yes. Now we have to give some text. Here, click on text. Here, I am writing one and OK. I am writing some six, four, two. I'm putting the item and I do not want this label. I'm clicking there and I'm showing. Okay, and I do not want these points also. Click, then control. Okay. Now it looks perfect. Now I have to create two buttons. One is to spin. Now, next is to stop. Now I need uh, alpha for this. So I'm just for copy paste purpose, I'm just putting it. Now we have to give commands here for click on object properties, scripts, on click, start, animation, open square bracket, alpha, comma, two. Now here also I am giving the match to stop. For that, instead of true, we have to give false. Now click on spin, you can see it is moving. Stop. What we need to do in the slider is we need to put this random. And I am making the speed 10. Now let's see. So I need we need a little bit uh, more speed. So instead of 10, I am putting 20. Spin. Stop. 3. So one person got three. Now one, two, three. Now again, I'm going to spin this. Stop. It is four. So another person got four. One, two, three, four. So like that, you can play the game. Whoever finished this first is the winner. I hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching my video. Bye-bye.